everything everything will be the remain same uh, could be the accuracy class or the protection 3p and the burden everything all the things will be the similar thing so there is a no main difference here in the capacitive voltage transformer so only one thing uh, generally in the capacitor voltage transformer is uh, this capacitor voltage transformers generally we are uh, uh, use uh, using for generally for two purposes one is if your substation communication is through plcc means power line carrier communication then you require this capacitor voltage transformer uh, otherwise not required and other one is uh, in a high, extra high voltage cases and ultra high voltage levels the capacitive voltage transformer will be the cheaper than the voltage transformer due to the uh, insulation cost so if you go for higher voltages from 400 kV above you can find the capacitive voltage transformers you uh, 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 instead of this uh, inductive voltage transformers so generally if you uh, there is a no much explanation in this capacitive voltage transformer the capacitive voltage transformer the, uh, the sizing is similar same to the voltage transformer but only one thing will be a uh, selection of the capacitor value that i will tell you how generally let's see how the circuit uh, drawing for this capacitive voltage transformer so this is the cvt which is connecting always from phase to ground so this we will call as a capacitor sorry capacitor uh, so these are the two the capacitors capacitor 1 and capacitor 2 and uh, out of these two capacitors will give me the resultant capacitance cn which are connected in a parallel so we are adding both the things in the capacitor um, then this is the induct uh, called as a uh, some coil inductor coil and uh, now here the voltage transformer will uh, us so this is the uh, inductive voltage transformer uh, this is the one and uh, this is we are having again one some resistor unit here and some phase compare them diode kind of thing so this is the network how it looks uh, generally so um, here uh, this uh, c1 uh, generally this capacitor one is obviously very much higher than the capacitor two capacitor two and this inductor principle this one and this resistor is to phase shift to for, for the phase shift now if i want to calculate the what is the output voltage the output voltage to the input voltage this is a v1 v1 which is applying here and this is the v0 we will get from here so v0 equal to what is our voltage divider principle c2 by c1 plus c2 which are connected in parallel into number of turns n2 by n1 into v1 this will gives me the output voltage output voltage so i have to select the c2 c1 and uh, c2 to get the required voltage and this c2 c1 and c2 is generally this also depends upon the one is a voltage magnitude other one if you are having a plcc communication uh, one so de demand from the plcc like frequency bandwidth and uh, some connection and this c1 c2 is also depends upon the manufacturer so instead of um, instead of uh, giving the c2 c1 all this th all these things uh, generally we will uh, ask the manufacturer that the resultant cn the most cn should be like uh, we are having a some wide range of values like 4400 uh, pico faraday 6600 pico faraday and 8800 pico faraday generally we will prefer for 220 kv all we are considering 4400 pico faraday and for 400 kv above we can see 6600 pico faraday so how we arrive at this is totally depends upon the voltage magnitude and also it depends upon the manufacturer dependent and also if there is a plcc it will also depends upon the bandwidth frequency and type of connections of the plcc that's about the cvtc no not not, not much discussion on this
remaining the burden calculation accuracy all the similar to the pt like 3p uh 233 by root 3 to 110 volts by root 3 same philosophy uh 3p class point to s class everything but then everything all sim similar the only thing here addition, uh, addition is the only the capacitor value that generally for 220k it is 4400 for uh, for uh, 30 uh, for uh, sorry 400 kV above you can see 6600 and above you can see 8800 microfarads yes so that's about this uh, capacitive voltage transformer thing